Welcome back to where I try to be Elden Ring with every weapon in the game and slowly kill myself inside. Uh, this time we're using the Envoy's Great Horn. I know I haven't uploaded in a long time and this playthrough is that reason. Uh, yeah, this sucked. I mean, I get Margit first try. It's it's not bad until the last two. It gets, it gets terrible. I'm also using Envoy's crown just to do extra bubble damage. Uh, dual wielding, I think I have the jump or raptor talisman uh, increase like jump damage. Uh, but this thing sucked like bad. It, it was not fun. But uh, yeah. Anyway, with Margaret down, we go on to Godric. I got him first try. Um, on to Godric, and I get him second try. But it was, he wasn't too bad. Uh, the bubbles are actually like deal a ton of damage when you can hit. I also brought the Bubble Boys along with me, like the Oracle Envoy, because I mean, why not? But later they just, I mean, start getting obliterated. Uh, R.I.P. Bubble Boys. On to the good boy, this uh, also easy fight, one try, like I don't think the fight lasted 30 seconds, it was so easy. And then we go on to the feet queen, I'm mm. oh, sorry, but uh, I got her also first try, uh, still, still easy, like I said, the first bit of this playthrough I thought was, oh like this is going to be a breeze, uh, uh, until the end. Uh, I'm still hurt and I've recorded this all this like like three months ago <sighs> yeah My car was also first try, easy, and then look at my bubble boys come in like this, like we look so badass, uh, I don't know, but we, we go against the Chronic Tree Sentinel, this was also first try, still easy up until this point, having, having no issues whatsoever. Then on to Godfrey, and I go to take my shortcut, and uh, I didn't make it. So I did some research. By research, I went back and tried it six more times, and came to the conclusion that yes, they patched my shortcut, and I was sad. Now I had to run through the entire capital. Then on to Godfrey, I was doing pretty good in this fight, and. The bubbles still doing a lot of damage. I didn't think they would. I thought he was going to be like immune to holy, but I guess he wasn't. And it was doing pretty good until this right here. Uh, and I got real greedy. I was like, you know what? I can get him. And just barely enough. And then he got me with his rocks. But that one bubble you see comes in clutch. And I beat him. <laughs> Godfrey uh, ended up taking me three tries, but I did get him on that one with the bubble. The first two, I wasn't doing too great, but that last one, I did good until the, up until the end. Uh, Morgat was two tries. Still, still breezing through this, like no problem. 
this is probably like within two hours of me starting this like easy simple I'm like I'm gonna wreck through this it's gonna be the easiest playthrough so far it it didn't turn out that way and with him down on the fire giant fire giant took me two tries and I'm just gonna let this one play y'all know how this fucking video takes uh or how long this boss fight takes. He's just got so much health. Especially on. Uh, like after new game plus 7. I think I'm on journey 16. I don't even remember. But uh, yeah. I'm just going to let it play. Y'all can fast forward like the next minute or so. And this will be over. On to the Godskin duo. Yes, I summoned Bernal, um, but you know I make my own rules to my own challenge. I I will never claim to be like, amazing at this game. So yes, I summoned him. Take take my gamer card away. Uh, but to make this fight easier, why don't you also use sleep pot? So I'm kind of trivialized this fight a lot. But if you think this is bad. That I summoned him. Just wait. <laughs> Alright, Godskin Duo took three tries. Malekith, also three tries. This is the one where I beat him. This one actually wasn't that bad. Uh, I do have Black Knife Teach now. Uh, so, I mean, say what you want. But it, it wasn't that bad. I thought it was going to be a little bit harder. And then we get to Gideon, and I'm ashamed to say this took me five tries. And this, this is where you're probably going to be like, yeah, he didn't beat up just the bubbles. Because as you can see, I just used a uh, rot breath with the dragon. And yeah, I'm sorry. But my excuse is, there's 300 something weapons in this game, and I'm trying to beat the game with every single one of them. And when a boss is taking me this long, yeah, I'm, I'm going to use some other things. Uh, I'm just saying. Because then we get on to Hora Low, Godfrey's first album, bitch. Um, yeah, so this took me 74 tries. <laughs> and I summoned real people because I suck at this game and I wanted to end myself. This sucked so bad. And... I don't even want to ever see this weapon again. Like, I'm probably just going to discard it out of my inventory completely. And the thing is, I have two other bubble weapons that I have to get through for this playthrough. 
Then on to Radagon and Elden Beast. This fight took me 27 tries. Also summoned other people and using a dragon because give me a break, please. So I came to the conclusion that since there are so many weapons in this game and I will not be able to keep my promise of beating the game with every single weapon, uh, you know, like one whole playthrough per weapon, I am going to do one weapon per boss but keep on going like only main bosses and keep on going like new journeys uh, I'm gonna try to like showcase different things uh, as I'm playing through like different ashes of war for like the basic weapons and stuff but to still make it somewhat challenging I can't skip weapons anymore like how I've been like jumping around to different weapons so I'll go back to the very next dagger I have to use and then go through daggers only, then straight swords, and so on and so on. So whatever boss that weapon lands on is what I have to do. Yeah. But anyway, if you're still with me, I'm going to continue trying to do every weapon. Just because I want to try every weapon. And I'm going to... Uh, try to upload these weekly depending on how fast I get through them I'm also got a lot of shit going on at work and I'm helping another friend get through this game and I'm playing other stuff because like I said this this playthrough killed me and it almost made me hate the game and it's like my favorite game like of all time this was bad it was really bad but Anyway, I'm just going to let the video play out, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Thank you for watching.